New fairy woods from Callaway. It is the Paradigm AI Smoked Fairy Woods. There are three of them to test today with Mr. Kevin Kraft here in the Trackman Bay at the Second Swing Minnetonka Tour Van. Make sure you're subscribed to the YouTube channel. You give this video a like and then tell us in the comments what you think of the new Paradigm AI Smoked Fairy Woods. Hey golfers, I'm Drew Mahold of Second Swing Golf, joined here by Kevin Kraft in the Minnetonka store. Kevin is a fitter at our Columbia store, um, but he's here in the Twin Cities today because of the new products. Yes. From Callaway. Fun. AI Smoke. Paradigm AI Smoke. Mm -hmm. uh, we've got Fairy Woods today. Yep. Um, we have three of the four models, the fourth being the uh, Max Fast version. Um, that's kind of like the lighter sw swing speed type. Yeah. Uh, but we've got the other three, and we'll do some testing today. So, um, Kevin, I know you're very particular about the way golf clubs look. Uh, so tell me what you first see, first impression here of these fairy woods. Yeah, it's they're they're clean. They're they're good. I like the. I, I am somebody that likes carbon. So the look of carbon, it's nice. They went away from the blue. And they've gone yeah. to a more mm -hmm. traditional kind of a dark gray, uh, kind of smoky, mm -hmm. I guess. Uh, yeah. Kind of kind of look. Um, color scheme's really good. Shapes stay. Pretty similar to last season, yeah, I, think. I think so. Um, you know, the, I've got the Max D in my hand. It's the it's got the the shallowest face, the largest kind of thumbprint here. Right. Um, you've got the the the, the Max, Max mm -hmm. which is going to be for most players. Yeah. And then we've got the Triple Diamond. So which that's uh, the one I'm very interested in. Yeah, myself, me too. But, me too. Um, so a couple of technologies to go through. Um, I mean, really, all of these, you know, the AI smoke metals have this. Mm -hmm. AI smart face, yes. Um, new kind of way of developing the face structure. Mm -hmm. Do some different testing using human golf swings versus a robot. Seems smart. Added some more valuables or uh, excuse me, variables, but also mm. it is valuable. Yes. Um, and so the result is a unique face structure for each individual club head in the AI smoke line. So, you know, three wood to driver to the irons. It's using this whole same method, uh, but also some of the technologies from the original paradigm are still there. Uh, the lighter and stronger carbon chassis. You've also got the tungsten speed cartridge on the bottom as well, which yep. actually was, I believe, a Rogue ST um, introduction. So all those things designed for high ball speeds, high launch, um, forgiveness, and of course now three models here. So we're gonna test yeah. them out. So uh, I guess I'll ask you the order in which you wanna test these out. Yeah. Well, I've got a shaft in this one. So okay. let's just go ahead and let's go max D, max, triple diamond. Okay, easy to tough? Yeah. Ish. Yeah. Okay. Sure. Let's do it. Yeah. Mr. Kraft, um, starting with the Max D, as you mentioned. Yeah. Talk to me about the shaft in there, and then also okay. um, we'll start with the appearance of that one first. Here. So new shaft for for 2024. This is Project X Denali. I've not had any experience with this shaft, so I'm excited to put it through its paces. This is 70 gram stiff flex. Mm. Um, nice, nice graphics. Yeah. Um, yeah, I'm, I've had a lot of success with Project X shafts in the past, so right. I expect this to be to be pretty good. Um, club head itself, the Max D is going to be the the most forgiving, the, the shallowest, the highest launching right. of the group. So, um, you know, we had a little bit of a, a movie reference in the in the hybrid portion where I, I brought up Roadhouse. Yeah. Um, did you see Gold Member? No. Oh, man. You've got so many comedies. You've got to you gotta caught, stop asking if I've seen oh, a certain goodness. movie. I, ha I most so, likely haven't. So, <laughs> all right. So my Gold Member reference is this. With this new golf club, you can have the Schmoke. And then, I mean, it's, it's I, I call it kind of, Pancakey, so you can have smoke in a pancake. It's a line from line from gold mm. member. Line from smoke gold member. Pancake. Yeah, <clears throat> okay. yeah. So yeah, the for me this one looks it's a bigger thumbprint, right? It's, right. It's, yeah. It's, you're looking. You're seeing more at a dress. Yeah. Yeah. It's wider. Uh, one thing I've liked about Callaway stuff all all through the the fairway wood line is you don't see a huge amount of of face. Uh, oh yeah. I like not seeing very much face so even on this model there's it's not it's not uh you don't you don't your eyes aren't drawn to the club thing no 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 definitely not okay. so uh, i like the new color scheme it looks good um i always found last year the the non-carbon portion 
in the front. Yeah, kind of like was, this, almost a black fleeting stripe. Yeah, was a little bit, I don't know, it was a little bit off-putting. Yeah. Um, this is better with the way the color scheme is, so okay. it's not, there's, there's just not quite as much division there. Sure. It looks like it flows into it a little bit better, so, yeah. So let's see what this golf club here does. Okay. Wow. For, How was that? For first swing in a little while, that felt pretty good. I didn't feel like I caught it toward, so I'm interested to see kind of I was what, gonna the, ask. That what is the spin a, rate goes. That's a knuckleball that, type that, of swing. That was definitely a knuckleball. I didn't, I didn't drop kick it, so yeah. yeah. All right, if anything, that was potentially a little thin. Okay. And a little hanging out to the right. Okay, so we doubled the spin rate. This is why they did human testing. Yeah, <laughs> this is why they did human yes. testing. I mean, the ball speed was actually better that time. It was. And I don't think, I didn't feel like I hit it as, as well. So. Hmm. That was off the heel. It's also gonna go left. Oh yeah. Oh, I got all the shots going right now. Right, now I want to see this dispersion for a second. <laughs> there it is. There it is. Beautiful. Beautiful. All uh, the shots, ladies and gentlemen. All the shots. <laughs> yep. Good. That's a good one. That's the shot. That's the one. Ah, okay. <laughs> Very good. Now, 241 is a good number. I like 241 from a fairway wood. And I like 3,000 from a fairway wood. That's yeah. good. Yeah. I think Trackman was just maybe getting warmed up a little bit. Maybe. Or you were. Maybe. Or both. Yeah. Couldn't possibly be me. Yep. Mm-hmm. He's found it. Maybe a little bit out to the right? Maybe. Yep. I... The spin I, didn't go up that much, though. No, kind of I couldn't tell whether that one was going to turn or whether that was just going to hang a little bit. I'm okay with that shot. That shot doesn't bother me. The yeah. one that went way over there and the one that went that way, I'm not particularly a big fan of. But Okay, you've... Okay. I think that's your... I, I swear Good. to God, that's your second shot with exactly 30 12 spin. <laughs> 30 12 Oh, 30, my. 12. That's pretty good. I, I had no idea. You ever done that before? Uh, I've probably done it before in the number of shots that I've hit, but uh, yeah, sure. I never this noticed. Is, so yeah. thanks for noticing. Yeah, this is a this is a fun dispersion circle. Uh, <laughs> actually, I'm gonna I'm gonna do it. Golf is hard. It's, you're gonna you're gonna have some of this with with a club that you were gonna be swinging that fast. Yeah, no, and everything. I, yeah, you know. totally. I'm gonna take this one out. I'm gonna take. This yeah, one that one was that one was definitely the cruddiest of the group. Okay, so this is a little bit better. I mean, again, we got one, four, five, and up here. Okay. From the, Seven shots, best five. We'll go. We'll do that with each club. Um, you really found a rhythm with these kind of four here at the end. Um, so the average there, carrying at about two thirty-eight point six, two fifty-eight point three total. Spin to thirty-two seventy-six. Uh, your thoughts there, Kevin? No complaints. No complaints. No complaints. Um, I guess overall, I don't love the the shape of this club for myself right um it, yeah you you wouldn't play a fairy wood with that big a footprint yeah yourself. it's just it's just big yeah. right for me this this one's just a little bit big but um in terms of feel i think it's a, a nice step up from from paradigm paradigm was good yeah uh this is definitely a little more responsive feels a little faster maybe uh just feels good feels mm. really good shaft is good took me a couple swings to kind of get in tune with Sure. With the way this this performs, uh, like I said, I've got no experience with this one at all, so I didn't know what quite what to expect. Um, feels good, loads yeah. and like, I like it. I like a golf, I like a shaft that I can kind of feel it loading and unloading, and uh, this one loads and unloads well. Sure. So yeah. Okay. And ultimately, you know, the spin numbers were were good, so it's yeah. probably a shaft that I would I would you know potentially be able to, to work okay. with. Yeah. Nice. All right. Sweet. Yeah, let's go then. Uh, we'll go to the Max, right? Yeah, yeah. Uh, just the, the standard Max version. Kevin, the Max standard. Yes, the yes. Max version. Now. Max. How, is that, what's the shape of that so, one? How does it differ? Yeah, it's it's a little smaller. Uh, it's getting back into that, more into that shape that, that I want to see. Yeah. Right. Um, 
pretty close to the same width, if not the same, uh, or you know, face height. So should expect a good a good launch angle here. Um, mm -hmm. Not going to have quite the the draw bias that that the uh, the D sure. has, right? So uh, this one looks good. I like it. I like it. Slightly off the toe. Oh. Yep. 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 Went far. It did go far. Ooh. Okay. Mm -hmm. Did that one feel toe or feel like a knuckleball? No, that one was actually Roasted. felt pretty solid. Yeah. yeah. Look at this. Seeing some some lower spins. Yes. Again. This is a good fairway finder ball mm. club for you here. If we turn down that loft. This one that might spin a more from the sound of it. Okay. A little more spin that time, yep. but still good. That came a little off the top of the golf club. Yeah, I sounded maybe a tiny bit like you were behind the, the ball, okay. but just a tiny bit. Okay, give it one more whack here. Oh, there's some speed. Ooh, ooh. We have some number Ooh. differences. Yeah. So. Ooh, pretty good consistency though. Overall. Carry total. Ah. Um, I'm gonna jump into the numbers first. Spin dropped quite a bit. Yep. Um, Smash Factor also dropped. That really? Could be. One four four. What's the list? <laughs> wow. Like your jump scare. Yeah, yeah. I didn't expect that. That did not I didn't feel all over the place. Really? No, not not at all. Hmm. Um You know, I had in the in the D I had you know, I had some little healy one and yeah, da, yeah. Da, 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 I, I could tell. I thought Now I granted hit, with the with the D we, we took out those, you know, we took out these two that were like, right. So right. Um, in that case, maybe I come up here and take out, you know, one four three here and um, one four three here. Sure. We get a little bit more close to the, together there. We kind of get a okay. one four five average, but okay. I, I I I felt like I hit this better than I hit the last. One. Okay. Yeah. And that could be maybe a, a glitch in, in the track man. Or something like that. Glitch in the Matrix. Or that. Um, <laughs> Since we're on movie references. Yeah, yeah. And another movie <laughs> reference that I've heard of a ton of times, but I don't actually think I've seen it. Um, ball speed, pretty similar. The yeah. Spin went way down, and that resulted in more total distance for you yeah. here. Oh, yeah. For sure. Um, launched higher. Yeah. With less spin. With less spin. Well, that's, that part's good. Yeah, for distance, that's yeah. very good. Um, how about overall heights, comparatively? Yeah, 90 to 96. Okay, all right. Uh, launch higher, spins less, gets less high. Didn't get quite the same landing angle. 10 yards longer in total, five yards yeah. long, four and a half yards longer in carry. So what do you think now on the triple diamond? What are we gonna see? I have no idea. That I have no idea. Answer I was hoping you wouldn't give. Yeah, I don't know. Um, this, I thought I hit. Well, I mean, you did. You did hit one. it well. Yeah, like I did hit it well, but it, the numbers, Trackman, Trackman says I'm not very good with this one. Well, that's <laughs> maybe a little harsh. I think it, you're still very good with it. Well, all right. Paradigm AI smoke, triple diamond. Okay. 
So far, I will say that both of these have felt very, very good. Yeah, you don't really have a three wood, so to speak, in your bag. I mean, you do the, you have the mini driver, which yep. sometimes acts as a three wood, but. It does. What would you anticipate a 15 degree three wood in your bag going, traveling, you know? I'd like to see 245 carry. Okay. Um, my two hybrid, as it stands right now, is a 230, 230, 235-ish carry. Right. So if I'm gonna if I'm gonna take it out and put this in when I've got a course that I know I've got par fives that I can get to, but I'm gonna need that extra firepower, I need that extra ten, right. 10 yards of carry. So um, so the triple diamond, I'm gonna gonna polish it up here just a, a little bit just because sure. I can't stand the look of fingerprints on top of the <laughs> golf club. I will stare at them uh, <laughs> like crazy. Um, yeah, so this this looks awesome. All right, it yeah. looks really good. Uh, you might, if, if anybody is thinking back to my early season, uh, what's in the bag, there was a Paradigm Trip. There was, in, yeah, in, in there was. In there in the, the beginning of the season. Um, Depends on which which what's in the bag that we that you're watching. I think there's a, there's how many, been a how many different versions of that did we put out last year? I think we did three. Well, counting the podcast that we discussed it, I think yeah. that's three. Yeah, that's not that bad. It's not like we did a new one every putter I put in the bag. So that would yeah. if we if we had to do a new what's in the bag for you every time we switch putters, it, we would run out of time to film things. So yeah. be filming too much. It's true. It's true. Okay. Um, more compact, deeper face. Um, no center line. Oh, no, like uh, alignment indicator? No alignment this? indicator. Yeah. Interesting. Okay. So I like it. Looks good. Looks looks aggressive. Let's see if I, I can, see if I can match the golf club. Okay. Okay. Oh, hey, guess what? That was exactly the carry number I was looking for. I was for. about to say. You said 245 carry. That yeah. is 245.9 carry. We should do a 245 challenge. <laughs> I don't even know where I would start with that. <laughs> this might be the one that goes 245.0. Here's some good numbers here. That was, that was lovely. That felt really good. That was sounded a little bit different. It was a little thin, actually. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Callaway has somehow found a way to keep the ball speed up on lower hits. With uh, not just three woods. Yes. With hybrids and yes. irons, as we've seen today. Yes. There seems to be a little something something in what they have been saying. Yeah. Which is nice, right? Truth in advertising, kind of good. Yeah. There. Yeah. I mean, false advertising is, is bad. Yes. Oh, ball speed. Wow. Okay, I got a little more spin. Got a little more spin, but got a little more ball speed. Got a little more height. That one was, that's pretty, those are pretty happy numbers, honestly. I mean, what else do you need? Sandwich. <laughs> hey, we're, we're, we're approaching lunchtime. Let's get, we're getting there. Okay, this thing's, this thing's fun. This thing's fun. No more shots needed? I don't think so. Yeah, I don't know. There's nothing really to remove here. Maybe this one that was your was slightly that my, low on the face. My, but again, yeah. look how fast that ball speed was still. Yeah, the ball speed really didn't drop a whole lot. Um, okay. Okay. <clears throat> Can I bring up dispersion too? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I All right. Will, uh, what, el what, do you, what else do you see from the numbers here? Or, or the map? Is there anything in particular you wanted to... So a little faster ball speed off this one than we had off the off the max. Yeah. Um, smash factor. Like I really felt like I hit this one and the max pretty much the same. Um, but smash factor yeah. definitely a little faster here. 
Uh, spin rate low with both of them. So maybe, maybe with the max, I was getting just tiniest bit of mat first. I, I didn't feel it. Yeah. But it doesn't necessarily mean it wasn't there. So, because I wouldn't expect the max to spin lower than the triple diamond. Right. I mean, that just doesn't. That's that's not golf clubs doing what golf right, clubs yeah, are supposed yeah. to do. Yeah, so and there's again, <laughs> over a larger sample size, I'm sure those things would ring yeah, true. Yeah. Um, but did here, launch a little lower. Um, yeah, it launched lower. I mean, it was the the triple diamond performed. I think exactly how we expected it to. Yeah, I mean, we were a little confused yeah. by some of the things that the max did. Yeah, um, and you know, I know your theory. You thought you hit the ball well, and so yeah. maybe there was a, a, a track man misread here or there. Um, be curious though, if, if you, the golfer, you get fit and you see the same thing, you know, or yeah. the max and the triple diamond perform very similarly, tell us, I mean, let us know that'd yeah. be, that would be, um, and if it does, that's cool. I don't anticipate right? that'll be the case for everybody. Yeah. If it does, then you, you've got a great choice of, you know, what you want to look at, you know, yeah, what, exactly. what, what feels more comfortable to you, you know, setting up, mm -hmm. do you like the more compact look? Do you like something that's a little tiny bit bigger? Do you like a little thinner face? Um, this to me is right where I want to be. Yeah, the triple uh, diamond. Yeah, this was this was great. It, yeah, this is uh, were, clearly there's numbers there's, are really good, and they all, all three of them performed really well. Like there's, I mean, look how fast these things are. are yeah, I off mean the club face. Yeah, or, ball speeds are really good. <clears throat> Carry yep. numbers are good. Yeah, you know, right around three thousand spin on the Smoke Max V, or yeah. a little over three thousand. We crept under three thousand for these ones, which is actually where you like it. Yeah. Um, yeah. So really good stuff. In, increasing distance throughout as well. So. Um, yeah, tremendous stuff here. Come really in, good. get fit, try out some new shafts, right? We got the, the, yeah, the new, the new shaft be, as well. be a nice one to, to work with, I think. Um, I think you'll be very pleased with the, the feel of, of this. Um, I'm quite happy with the, with the feel. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. I, think, I mean, think it's a little, it's a little lighter and livelier feel than the, than the, the paradigm. paradigm. Yeah. Well, that's a pretty good indication to come at least try them out. So, uh, yeah. Without further ado, let's wrap up with final thoughts here. Sure. All right, Kevin, testing complete. Paradigm yep. AI Smoke Fairway Woods. We tested three models. Um, overall, your, I guess, takeaways from the testing, and then we'll dive into each one in particular. They're all good. Yeah? Yeah, they're all good. I got no complaints about the kind of performance, the kind of feel uh, off of any one of them. Mm. They've, they've really performed very, very well. Um, some difference in looks, yeah, obviously. Yeah, uh, you know, if you look at the bottom of the the triple diamond, we don't have the the smoke pattern here that sure. they, ha they have here. Um, that's just yeah. pure, pure aesthetics. I like right. the I like this little smoky, yeah, that's kind smoky of thing they got going smoky. on. Yeah. yeah. Um, um, let's start with the Max D. This is the first okay. one you hit. Yep. Um, you can kind of categorize or characterize the type of player that would fit into this. This club here. So the individual that's looking for a little higher launch, um, both the Max and the Max D have the, the shallower face. Yeah. Uh, the D is going to be a little more draw biased. So if you've got somebody that's having a hard time getting that club face squared, this is going to provide a little bit of forgiveness to it and a little mm -hmm. more, a little more uh, assistance trying to get that club face squared up. Right. Um, but it could be literally for anybody that wanted to play it. Yeah. Yeah. There's Clearly we saw, I mean, I also didn't, we didn't really talk about the fact that it's a draw, kind of a draw bias. And yeah. You still had the leftmost. You know, yeah, it was the leftmost left, was the most leftmost? Uh, sure. Sure. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. We'll go with that. Uh, but not left, left. No, 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 no. Yeah. No. Other than the one that we removed that you have the heel in the left. Yeah. That was, that was a year. That was, yeah. That was just, um, just wanted to make sure I reminded you of that shot. Yeah. So. Thanks. Uh, okay. Next one. The Max. <laughs> AI Smoke Max. Yep. Um, I imagine this is to be the one that maybe appeals to the most players. Out yep, there. you'll you'll get the the most people are going to go into into this one again. Same kind of shallower face mm -hmm. that we have in the Max D, neutral. You know, Switzerland, no no bias one way or the yeah. other. So um, yeah, this is going to be the one for 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 most every man. Yeah. yeah, yeah. And then the one you have there, the triple diamond. Yep. Um, as we I mean, the performance on that one for you is awesome. Low spin and kind of a piercing ball flight. Yeah, love uh, that for players that have probably a higher swing speed or need spin reduction or both. Yeah, if you're looking to have something as a good long club, next club down from driver, mm -hmm. this will this will serve us nicely. Yes, exactly. So 
Paradigm, AI Smoke Fairway Woods. Uh, make sure you get fit for yours yes. here for 2024. They're going to be awesome. Uh, and as performance saw today, they're, you can line that up for yourself, and you're going to hit a heck of a lot better golf shot than your fairway woods. So, yeah. Kevin, thanks for doing all the testing today and, sure. and giving us the, the breakdown. This is going to be awesome, and I know I know you're going to fit a lot of customers into these this year. Yeah, they're going to like the feel. They're going to like the feel of this a lot. It's quite good.